Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Nobody Plays Pokemon Legends Arceus. You know, I never noticed there's fire in there. Good low quality, but oh well. Also, another thing I forgot to show off. Oh, I have over 200. I found fire stones. Like, four of them. Just because I was breaking stuff trying to get Geodudes out. And then I just needed more because I needed... Well, I got 900 of these, so that should explain why I have so many. Was I specifically going here? Oh no, it just wanted me to leave. Yes, technically I defeated one. Extra 10 points would be... Defeat... I didn't know he was going to say something. He defeated Cleaver. Time to head back to the village and report to Commander Commodo. I saw the light fading into the sky. You must have called the Lord... The Lord Pokemon. What do you have there? Could it be... Ah, those are the two favorite plates of all! Please, let me have a look! I see there are some letters carved into them. Let's see, this one says, Where all creation was born, that is the being's place of origin. It seems to be a phrase or a very old myth. How'd you come across these? Or did Cleaver gave me one? I see. So you were given the plates when you impressed word to your Aunt Cleaver. That is quite something indeed. My heart is practically racing with excitement. It is my guess that you will find more places like these scattered across this city. If we... If we were to gather them all in the side of the scripts and then we can uncover something absolutely amazing. The mysteries of the past. Oh, how they tickle my curiosity. What joy to be alive in such times. Well, I must be on my way. Until next time. Ta-ta! Get him balls to waste. Don't even get there. More for the next time I can catch a Pokemon. Granny. More quests. Some more quests. A peculiar pony talk. Yeah, a fellow from the village claims to have seen a rather strange pony talk. You must investigate the matter for a good of science. Oh yeah, by the way, the Bidoof one and the Drifloo one came from this board. I'm not sure I want to waste the Feather Balls first. Oh, I think I know where this peculiar ponytail is supposed to be. Excuse me, sorry about that. Hey, listen to this. I saw something out in the wild. Oh, it was incredible. What was it? The thing I saw was a will o wisp, a ball of bright red fire. I was walking on this step run the other night and leapt out and be like, woo! Again with the story, huh? I'm oh, sorry, not that walker. Illustrator, mister, my big sis always gets carried away with her fairy tales. For goodness sake, I'm not making it up. I saw that will o wisp with my own two eyes. Oh, yeah? Then why don't you show it to me? Ha, huh, good luck with that. It's so frustrating, he won't believe me. I honestly did see one. Say, you're the survey corps, right? And I hear you're quite the prodigy. I bet you could easily catch that will o wisp. Don't you think you're gonna catch one that I saw and bring it back here? Oh, 
god, am I getting quests out the ass? What the fuck is happening here? The fuck is who? You're here about the point on our quest, right? Glad to have some help. Oh, this the Why did you, why did you point me to someone whatever? Here's the problem, a ponytail like no one's ever seen before has appeared in the horseshoe plain. Looks so different that the other ponytail than the other ponytail. A little scary to be honest. When I told the person he got all excited about research again, so we agreed to have the ponytail survey and see what's the what. If we head to the horseshoe plane and catch the strange ponytail for us, it'd be really helpful to us. Here, Civic Core Kid. I saw the darnest thing. I was scouring the heart heartwood for crops we could grow in the fields. Here, when I saw it, Pokemon culture in changed its appearance before my very eyes. I was in the evening, the light was getting dim. All of a sudden, Trim's petals closed right up, so it looked like nothing but a little flower bud. Whoa, I thought. I just witnessed the miracle of evolution. Next morning, when I went to go check on that trim, it was right back to full bloom. But why would the bloom just close back up? Is that how evolution works? Or was the change I saw something different? When you find Trim's Pokedex entry, let me have a look, would ya? The bloom or not the bloom? I need to have his Pokedex entry, huh? Well, it's only at research level 5, so... Honestly, I need to use Agile... I probably should use Agile Style and then Pedal Dance. To at least get the last 5 so I can get them up. Yes, nothing happens. Yep, nothing happens. Anything fucking else? Oh my god, there's something right there. It's just a dirt streak across the mountain. So you are apparently Flynn's ancestor? I did not even notice. You there, you seem to be like someone who enjoys a bit of crafting. You think you can help me out with something? I'd be very very grateful if you try to craft something using a special recipe I came up with. So without further ado, here's the recipe. Okay, she does. Three logs of wood. This is a recipe for what I've named Poker She Dolls. I invented them, you see. A special item that we could make in this village. I would love to have you craft one and show it to me. I'm looking forward to seeing what you can come up with. I don't have logs of wood right now. Logs of wood are currently in here. Oh, here they are. Interesting. Interesting. I made a Pokeshi doll. Imagine that wasn't a quest that you're supposed to bring the three wood and make it in front of him. this? Why has a Pokeshi doll if I ever seen one? Please, let me have a closer look. Amazing! Just look how smoothly you've carved these curves! Your attention... Your attentive carving shows you put love and care into your handiwork. 
and these colors, you've definitely given it a vivid look, that's for sure. Yes, these hues must be the very shades of our inner strength and passion. Not to mention, this Pokeshi doll is perfectly balanced. At a glance, you'd think it's sure to fall over, and it, it stubbornly remains upright. Phew, thank you. I've served your Pokeshi doll to my heart's content. We use the same recipe, and yet your Pokeshi doll has come out a completely different feel than mine. Here, I'll give you a Pokeshi doll I made. I took great care of craft because they're here. Let's have a look at it and see how different it is from the one you made. It looks exactly the same because I got two! the will-o'-wisp. I think that only happens at night, so if I stall long enough considering it's sunset, night can come. No, no more again. I'm gonna do this, hell yeah! Then jump! And then you fucking book it. A blue ponyta. Oh, it's an unusual ponyta. Yes, I know that sound far too well, game. What the hell did that sound? I'm trying to catch this little fucker with a back strike, but he just will not stop walking. And then he turned around. And now he's running back across the water. The hell are you? Are you fucking kidding me? That's just an Eevee! Okay, I got another Eevee! Those are fucking rare. That's not what I was wanting currently, but, um, I got... I was wondering, it's like, no, no Bidoof runs that fast. You didn't see anything. Why don't I caught the shiny? How do you use your pulling time? Time to report back to the village. That's motherfucking Alpha Bidoof. What the fuck? Okay. Which means I can start looking for a big breeze, a little breeze, like start fucking looking for alphas and catch that little shit. Where's this Will O Wisp? I gotta go down there. Okay then. Yes. Have I ever been up here? Yes, yes I have. It's up here I wanted to get to. Skyrim. Come on, jump. Yeah, too tall. That one's probably a bit too high for me.
There's a duty in that. Chunk. Sweet, I made it up here. Now what? There's literally no reason other than there's a sky tumble stone. And maybe like two pieces of iron. Two iron chunks. Chimchar? I've already cut several of you. Battling? Can I catch him instead? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I gave it time to wait. Okay, yes, it's still there. I had the falcon and I don't understand that. Yeah, that's yes, you can learn swift now. I have four times to catch him. Huh? It's turn time vulture balls to come into play. Battle. Let's put it. I can make ultra balls. And I cut out the chimchar. No car. I'm sure the chimchar you cut. Do I have to actually show them? Show them. There's a chimp that you showed four of one. Well, yes, because I cut like three others beforehand. He just gave me an extra one, and I still need one more though. My foot. Look at my foot. So I gotta be on the. I can now. That's, that's amazing. After I took out that alpha Pokemon, I can now be on the lookout for alpha Beedoofs. Alpha Beed. Alpha Weasels. Yes. Two of them fill my Actually, technically three of them do. I think if I didn't catch an Eevee, I probably would have left. Yes, one more after 25, though. Yeah. Because I threw it, it heard me, so it technically spotted me. And I just caught one army at 10. Yeah, that, that was in battle. That fucking spotted me for sure. <laughs> Nothing spotted me. Four different points. Return to the village, duh. And this bridge down, Yota? He was coming out of the gallery with surprise when he saw a pointing to a herd. In the fields, he couldn't wrap his head around the fiery remains. And I thought it would have been odd to be amazed. But now that I know some pony to a blue flame, I such a stretch to think there might be all sorts of them out there. I'm not just talking about pony mine. mind. Who knows how many different colored Pokemon there are in the world? But the survey corps keeps trying his level, keeps trying his level best to research them all. I think you're making that easier, Yota. Are you coming to show me that little bit I saw? Technically, if you want to be specific, it was this one right here. The others are... Yeah, it's the one that caught. It ran up the tree again. 
that's it. That's really what I saw all of them, right? So it was a Pokemon all along. In any case, you kind of just see problems. Slavery and Korra really are a talented bunch. Now I just have to explain the whole thing to Waka somehow. Can't say I'm looking forward to that. Gah! A Will-O-Wisp! No! Save me, sis! Ah! For the Eastern for you. Oh, I shit, it fucking leveled up. Holy hell. I'm gonna use you. A wooden toy carved from the image, it can be sold at a general store. I thought it was just a Pokemon toy you used to distract them. Pokemon and run. It's like a stone for a thousand. Yeah, and pieces of wood only get combined. Three of them combined can only get me on my... Uh... 600. I could get 400 more from that. Interesting. I think that's all the quests I can do, though. Oops. Yeah, it's all the quests I can do right now. So I need Cherim to get higher up. Also, I do not remember being able to fly to all these areas. Wait, what? Good night's sleep like this. What? Don't scare me like that. Don't that scary. I don't know, everything's fine. Whatever you need, come back later, alright? <laughs> Maybe a survey core type like you could figure out what's causing this. Look, if I'm in the quarters trying to sleep at night, feels it feels like I'm not alone in there. Sometimes there's this kind of crackling sound. I found burnt berries a couple of times, and once in a while, I heard some clatter. So, survey my court kid, go survey my quarters. Figure out what's wrong. Figure out what's happening. What's wrong? Why is he doing this? Just do it at night, would you? God, he had worked in the day. Ready to go see my place? Yeah, I thought I could just go up to the door. I don't have to talk to you. There's something in there. Check every nook and cranny for me, okay? I should have ended this episode a while ago, but it just keeps going. Architectural plans. Let's catch a magic up too. Perhaps it's part of the plans of the galaxy hall. Call for me if I'm here. Okay, I don't know what that did. Faint smell. It seems like barriers have been present here. Those doors from the entryway. Hits me from beneath the cloth. Crackle, crackle. You saw sparks fly for a moment. It seems like something ran by you. There's no, he's back in the closets. Well, the door is open just a crack. Do you want to peek inside? There's some weird clothes and a cape inside. In this closet? Yeah, do you want to peek inside? 
thing is like special models. A model with a ghetto sculpture on it. Perhaps it's an early design for a galaxy hall. Mm. It's gotta be this thing then. It's a fucking Pichu! It's a very cool kid. Are you right? I heard this strange noise. Wait a minute, this Pichu, could it be? It might sound absurd, but I think this might be a Pichu I found ancient in the forest a while back. I still need data for that, can I capture it? A berry? For me? What, because I fixed you up? Chew. Wait, so the thing haunting my quarters was just a grateful little Pichu? Guess all the worry was pointless. I think I was afraid it was some spine-chilling thing. I owe you one. How token my gratitude. Hey, Nana Berries. I don't want that peach here. I still need it. I guess this is your house now. Alright, we're done here. What's the last request? Yeah, looks like that's just that. I was the wrong button. Yeah, I think maybe we'll show something here. Yeah, I don't see anything. Well, anyway, time to end this episode off here. That took a while for quests. See you all next episode, everyone. Bye.